secret boyfriend, hate cheerleading, missing leg bones, lying about my age. So I just wanted to clear this up. Hey guys, it's Anna and in today's video, I'm going to be reacting to your assumptions about me because this kind of video was trending on YouTube a little while back, but I never did it. So I thought now would be better late than never. Basically how this is going to work is I asked on my Instagram story for any of your assumptions and now I'm going to be going through and responding to them. So let's just go ahead and get right into it. The first one is that I'm shy, which I would say is true because I've always been pretty shy, but I don't think I'm as shy now as I used to be when I was younger because I used to be extremely shy if I didn't know the person. The next person said that I secretly hate cheerleading, which is false because I love cheerleading and if I didn't like it anymore, I wouldn't still be doing it. This one I'd actually say is the opposite of me because I'm definitely a not a big partier and I've never drank alcohol or vaped. The few parties I have gone to, I was like the only one that wasn't drinking so I didn't really have a very good time and ended up leaving really early. So yeah, I'm not really much of a partier and even when I am legal drinking age, I'm probably still not going to drink just because it's not really something that interests me. You hate getting ready to go out. P.S. If you actually put this in your vid, I love you. First of all, love you too and I actually love getting ready to go out because since I do a lot of things at home when I can actually go out and get dressed up or something I find that actually really fun. You only wear active wear. This one is kind of true because I do have a lot of active wear and wear it almost every day because it's so comfy but sometimes when I go out I don't wear active wear so it's not the only thing I wear but I do wear it a lot. That was pretty funny so they said that I'm missing leg bones which is definitely not true because if I was missing leg bones I don't think I would be able to walk. The next assumption is that I'm taken but actually I'm single. I saw a lot of assumptions in there that I had a secret boyfriend but that is not true. You are an only child. I feel like a lot of you already know this because I've done some videos with her but in case you don't know I'm not an only child. I have one sister named Grace. <laughs> Five foot. I think I'm around four foot eleven, which is only one inch difference than five foot, so you're actually really close. You love editing YouTube videos. Yes, I do love editing videos. It's definitely one of my favorite parts of doing YouTube, except for helping you guys with your flexibility. You like your fan pages. Of course I do, they're always so supportive and make the coolest edits, so I love my fan pages. You stretch for several hours a day. I feel like this one's going to surprise a lot of people, but no, I do not stretch for several hours a day. I probably stretch for around 15 minutes a day on average. I don't really time myself and sometimes I'll find myself just doing like random flexibility things around the house. I don't know exactly how long I stretch, but if I'm filming a YouTube video or making a flexibility TikTok, I obviously do stretch for longer on those days. You do YouTube for money. I feel like by now everyone knows that YouTubers make money on their videos, but that's definitely not why I make videos. When I first started my channel, I didn't even know that I could make money on the videos, and if that's why I was making videos, I definitely would not be doing stretching tutorials and would just be doing videos that everyone would be curious enough to click on so they get tons of views. But for me, I care so much more about being able to help you guys improve your flexibility and learn new tricks and also just be entertained with my videos. It means so much more to me to see a flexibility improvement from just one person than how much money I make on a video. So even though I do think it's important that I can monetize my videos because otherwise I wouldn't be able to spend as much time making them, what matters the most to me is that I'm helping you guys through my content. You have never been to Australia. No, I haven't been to Australia, but I definitely want to travel there one day. 
it. You would try rhythmic gymnastics. Love you so much, Anna. Love you too. And yes, I would love to try rhythmic gymnastics because I feel like I'd really like it, but it's not really popular where I live. So there's nowhere else around here that I can really try it. You are more of an introvert than an extrovert. I wouldn't say I'm like a crazy introvert because I do love to travel and meet new people and stuff like that. But I would say this one is pretty true. You are going to move to New York. Obviously right now travel is not an option, but once it is an option, I would love to live part time in either New York or LA. social media. That's definitely not true. I love doing social media and I'm going to do it for as long as I can. You don't do cheer anymore. Right now I actually am still doing cheer. You are a people pleaser. Okay, this one is definitely true. 99% of your clothes are from Gymshark. Not gonna lie, I do have a ridiculous amount of Gymshark clothes, so I'd say this one is pretty true. Your hair is fake. No, my hair is not fake. I don't even dye my hair, so it's completely real. You really want to have a merch line. I do and I'm actually working on something really exciting now but it's more of a secret project at the moment and I have no idea when it's going to be done so I can't really give any details on it at the moment. You don't plan on going to college. So for this one I'm not really sure. I know this year I said that I was taking a gap year but I feel like I'm also not going to go next year just because I absolutely love what I'm doing right now so I want to do this for as long as I can. So maybe five ten years down the road I'll go to college. I have no idea but for now I do not have plans to go to college. You are not 18. So this is something I've noticed a lot in my comment section, not really on here and Instagram as much, but a lot on TikTok. So I just wanted to clear this up and say that yes, I am 18, even though some of you think that I look younger. I know I do look young for my age and I would show you like my ID or something for proof, but I feel like if I put that on the internet, someone would take it and try to like steal my identity or something. So I'm not going to do that, but my birthday was April 20th. 26, 2002 so I'm 18 and I have videos on my channel like my high school prom and graduation if that helps to clear up my age for you. So that is the last assumption I'm going to answer today so I really hope you guys enjoyed watching today's video. If you did make sure to give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel and don't forget that once we hit 2 million subscribers I'm going to do my first ever live stream stretch and Q&A. Bye!